quick tutorial how to um, write an image. Forget about writing. I found a loophole. I make it easy for you guys to get my build. The easiest way. Very simple. Here is a uh, micro SD, one terabyte. Got an Amazon, 50 bucks, right? I'll leave a link. Okay. It's best if you have an adapter like this. 3.0 for faster transfer, right? So I'm plugging in here, 3.0. There it is. As you can see, it's gonna pop right up. I'm gonna go to my PC. As you can see, volume D right there, right? So, I'm gonna exit that out. Go down to uh, this PC, volume D. Rename it. Must follow my, st my step. You skip one, you're gonna start all over. Rename, all right? Bobby B. O B B Y C E R A Bobby Sierra Space Counter C O U N T E R A B E Counter Oh Go to um Rename I forgot Format Oh yeah forgot uh Format Format My bad Click on NTSF, default size, NTSF, default size, right? Now, see that? B O B B Y C E R A, counter key. C, capital C, O U N T E R, and a capital C again, A D E. As you can see, Bobby Sear counter key. Now, format, quick format, right? Let's do a quick one. Super easy. As you can see, it's done. Open that up. There it is. And here, when you download um, my bill, right? You see this folder? Copy and paste. See that? Open it up. Highlight everything. Drag it over. It's gonna take about two and a half to three hours. It is uh, under 600 gigabytes. So I cram everything in here. As you can see, it's 593, under 600 gigabytes. When's that, when it's done, I'll be back and I'll show you the next step. Oh, also, uh, Huge shout out to Mystery Encoder. Without them hacking the PCB, none of this would happen. Also, most importantly guys, you must hack your PCB, YouTube it, it's everywhere, very easy. Hack it first before you copy my bill, right? Hack the PCB, will work on all counter K, no, I mean the, the two player, the white one. Uh, uh, what's gonna call it? Marvel, the Marvel superhero, and uh, NBA Jam Turtle, and MK, right? And uh, I have a special announcement at the end of the video. I'll be back. All right, boys, it is finally done. Now, I made this very easy. Let me explain. I was gonna create an image, and then you're gonna have to use a Windows 32 to write the image. Now, I made it even easier, just copy and paste without writing any image or, or without using any software. Just a, your mouse, keyboard, and a PC, copy and paste. All right, now it's done. I got this mini um, USB adapter, it's very tiny. Not recommended, but it works. You know, it loads. It's a time of loads. Let me explain. The micro, the micro USB, goes, the micro SD goes in here. It, it, 
kind of tend to get like heat up. You get what I'm saying? Like in here. Hold on a second. Be right back. Let me plug this in. All right. Loading up. As you can see. Once load up, uh, the volume is not going to work. I'm going to show you a real quick to make it work. All right. Right now. 22,824 games. I have good news and bad news. Let's go to the smallest files with new deal. So a little quicker. All right. This is this is to enter. It's to back. Same as the rest. As the same as you no, know, it operates the same exact thing as a Pi and a Batacera. It's the, both the same exact thing. Use MLS. Now, that low, right? And you can see it works. You see the volume? Now the volume works, right? Now to exit, you press play one start, play two start at the same time to exit. So follow my walkthrough tutorial and navigate through everything. I want to show you, this is a uh, Street Fighter layout style. Jab, strong and fierce, short, forward, and roundhouse. Remember that. Play one start, play two start. Let me set up my camera. I'll be right back. All right, how's that? Now I'm gonna press this two to exit, right? <coughs> okay, this, let it exit. And my beer, my minchilada, got my pizza going on, all right? Now it's back, press back, right? Now, before I start, must give credit where credit is due. First of all, Team Encoder. Woo! Thanks for the soft mod. Guys, before you load in my build, you must do a soft mod on your PCB on the counter cave. Second, uh, my boy, Scotty Retro. Woo! I asked him to make me an Asian themed dragon and more. I give him the idea. And he do his dirty magic. Thank you, Scotty Retro. Woo! We got more collaboration. I'll announce later. And um and Vic Win, my man, boy, he is good. Uh he showed me a trick to get access some files to a uh, um to Steam Deck, right? To get into the Linux build. Easiest way. Man, that was easy. Thanks, Vit. Man, he's the man. He he knows a lot of stuff. I learned a lot from Vit Rian. Thank you, Vit. AKA Beefster. Alright, let's talk. Let's let's get to uh let's get to the game. As you can see, the bad news. Let's talk, let's talk about bad news. Bad news, no video snap. Reason if I if I add video snapping here, everything will clutter, will lag. Second I tried 32,000 game without video snap. Oh my God, it lags. I tried 26,000 game, I lower it. It still lag. And I finally got to 20, a little over 22, almost 23,000 game and works fine. You will get a little hiccup here and there. Some freezing due to the RAM is cluttered. You know, everything is like, I don't know why PCB suck balls. It's a piece of shit PCB. But anyways, at least I got it working. And some game will not run well. Like uh, the arcade, motor comeback, stutter, sound, lags. It runs, but I'll show you a little video. Unless there's a, a correct ROM for a V33, but I couldn't find it. Also, CSP3 will not load. Hopefully someone can fix that. So basically I found a loophole. Instead of creating an image, I made it copy and paste for everyone, including all your all your top guys knowledge about the the build of the image. So I left it open so you guys can edit and tweak it, add more games if you want. Not recommend it. 
uh, you do whatever you want with it. So this is free for public. I made it special for um, Christmas build. This is a Christmas build for the community. So it will be available in a couple of days in Discord first. In the PRU Discord, pack our us, woo! So members in Discord will get this first, and then public release on RK Punk. Let's get this started, right? This Konami, this Midway, you see, you see my build, like for instance, it's stuttered a little bit, you see that? So, on a fresh, on a fresh new um, copy built on your micro SD, you gotta have to wait like a few time, turn off and on for it to load. Everything is about almost 23,000 games. So it's loading right now. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna shut it off and turn it on because it's a fresh new build that you just copy and paste over. So you gotta let everything kick in, just like the ad games. You gotta let everything kick in in order for everything to run smooth. So it's gotta give it some time for everything to load up. What? Mm. My pizza. As you can see. Mm. I had my own BGM. Right? It's a little bit of a PlayStation game. What's good? What's good? That loads, right? Let me show you an example. Say, if you're playing a game and your video is, is slowing down, stuttering, right? I'm gonna show you how to get in. It looks like this video here is stuttering, right? Skip all this, it's too much. Okay, it's loading. Let's test. Like, see, this game is, is slow. So what you do, you press the second player right here. Second player, black button. Play, second player start. And a short kick. At the same time, you go with a retro arc, right? You go press uh, the forward kick, go back. And then you go to setting. Go to video. You see the thread, video thread right there? The thread, I highlight it. Click the short to enter on. Hopefully, no more lag issue. Go back to quick menu and resume. All right, I see it's smooth now. You see that? No more slowing, lag. Easy fix, as you can see. Now it runs pretty smooth now. Right? Normal lag. As you can see earlier, it was laggy. Now it makes it out. Now to get into rect a retro arc, okay? Make sure you, you navigate to that video. Switch it to the other way. Whatever way it's on, if it's on and off. If it's on, turn off. If it's off, it turn it back on. Right? So, this is per game. 
I just show you an example. That was the PlayStation. Let's go to um popular game. Let's go 32x. But sometimes it takes a long time to load, right? It's 32x. I don't know which one to load. I have no idea. Let's try that one. Oh, I left one video. It's still cluttered. I finally solved the problem. Oops. Uh, let's count my script again. Uh, Start new game. This is the thirty two X, right? Actually, thirty two X runs pretty well here. As you can see, it's thirty two X. Exit out. I'm trying to run maybe uh, some. Well, Street Fighter is working there. So I left it open for you guys. This NBA Jam. Let's try NBA Jam, right? Oh, it's still, you know what? Let's try Promo Rage. How's that, huh? We see how Promo Rage runs. Skip all that. Okay. Is it slowing down? I'm not even sure, but I'm gonna go back to a retro arc, right? Press back, press the four key to go back and go to setting video. Go to thread video, let's turn that back on over there. Let's see what happened. Let's see, is it smooth? Go to, back to a quick menu, resume. See how smooth this thing. Earlier when I jump is kind of slow, right? Look at that. A little better. See that? See earlier, remember I jump is kind of like you know like slowly moving. Second player. All right, that's it. Let's exit out. That's thirty two X. Not bad. Good hack. Runs pretty smooth. Alright, that's enough, that's enough, alright? That's enough. Might get hooked. Let's get out of 30 check up here and there. You know what I'm saying? Let's try this one. Sega City. This is as good as, as the Pi 3. You know what I'm saying? Just take a CD and uh, let you know that uh, some game 
uh, well, actually, lots of, you know, old, old retro gaming, like Commodore, Amiga, you know, C64, you need a keyboard. What you're going to do is you can use a um, USB hub, plug in a keyboard on the side here, put a USB hub, and, you know, put it in, keyboard, play it. And then you can also use a Bluetooth with the USB hub. So connect Bluetooth and map map your Bluetooth controller into the Barracera. Easy maps go to into the uh, emulation station menu and just remap it. It will detect the Bluetooth, right? Okay, Sega City, pretty, pretty good. How do you double, double jump? Okay, that's right. That's good. All right. Now, there's more things I want to tell you, but I forgot. Let me walk through this, and hopefully, I can remember and tell you guys everything. This is like by far the easiest video I made for the community without any software, no need uh any software to write this image. All you need is a PC. As you can see, look, it froze, right? Like I say, you get a little hiccup. Like in games, all right? This one. Start like guns. This does not load, right? What you do is you press start right here. You go to system setting. And then you go to developer. And then you go scroll down. Redetect all games lang uh lang and region. So like that, let it do it. Go back, go back, hit a reboot. And the light guns, right? Let's go back to light gun and see if it works. <coughs> Try this one. You know, it's possible you can use the sending light gun in here because no need sensor. So you can have a border, right? So it's too small to have a, uh, to put a light gun on this, but you know, cool idea. Unless, they, unless um, someone can mod a small, <laughs> small, small gun. That's not about you, it's a little too loud there. There it is, my gun games. What did I press? Let's go down. Alright, oh, let's sweep. Still loading? Damn! It took a long time to load. Jeez, skip all that. There's gotta be a PlayStation version in here.
So this one for reload and one for shoot. The short, reload, forward and shoot. All right, there's your light gun. That's it. All right. Mm. Not all will work. Take a look. Arcade. Uh, Acclaim. Two games. Alpha. Nineteen game. Atari Classic. I'm not testing none of this because tch. all this Van Bristol Capcom Classic. All right, cave. Now, not all cave will work, right? It's like some cave game. Let's try the screen resolution, right? Let's try this. I haven't tried it yet. Yeah. Let's try it. Let's go into Retro Arc. You know, I'm like for example, see this? Go into Retro Arc. <clears throat> screen overlay. Oh, sorry, that was what does it do? Let's see. Menu. Oh, let's go back. Uh Let's go to go back, go to setting. Uh, look for aspect ratio. I think it's in the video, huh? Is it? Video. Oh, here it is. Scaling right here. Oh, let's go to scaling. Let's go to full screen mode. Oh, no. Uh, right. No, let's go back over here. Let's go scaling aspect here. Aspect ratio. Under scaling, go aspect ratio, right? And then you just go to your right. Right again. Until you see a nice fit screen. Uh huh. Somebody's at the door. Custom. No, uh, aspect ratio, full, that's nice, quick full, inner scale, no, nope. take that out, crop, no, nope. mm. it's like window mode, no, nah, I don't want to mess with that, but anyways, let's go back, quick menu, resume, oh, I think I press two player, okay, am I, this is two player mode, Very smooth. There's something wrong with this aspect ratio here. Uh, let's go to back. Setting. Video. Scaling. 4 by 3 Is, is this 4 by 3 I think it's 4 by 3 right? 16 by 9 16 10 I think it's four by three. Five by four? Is it five by four? Six by five? No. Four by three? Yeah, four by three. Uh. Let's go back, go back, go back. Put me in the zoom. But anyways, that works good. All right. That's cave. <clears throat> Exit out. All right. That's cave. <clears throat> Exit out. Yes, it does, kids. 
it does take a while. Let's cave. Um, Comet Industry uh, Capcom system right here. Capcom 2. Let's try uh, Street Fighter, right? X Men is, you know, Eric Doc Stalker is here. Street Fighter. Ex example. Yeah. See how Street Fighter works? Street Fighter is my main game. But I do not recommend playing Street Fighter on this little counter case. You literally lift it up, try to do some some uh, upward cuts and some crazy moves. Oh, no, it's a no no. So this will work. My build will work on all counter K. Not all. I meant like you know the the Marvel, the NBA Jam. Not recommend NBA Jam only two button turtle. Not recommend turtle only uh, MK and uh, and this one. Okay. For my build. Okay, that works. Exit out. This is a Street Fighter gym. Let's try the gym. Like this. this one here. This is pretty cool. There's Alpha 3, Alpha 2, right? Let's try this one here. Street Fighter gym fighter. The uh, uh, Capcom gym fighter. That's pretty awesome. <clears throat> Took a while to load, but it works. Who cares, right? There it is. Oh, two, two credits to start. Expensive. <clears throat> Oops. Oh, what did I press? Shoot. I pressed something. Fix it out. Damn it. See, that's when you're in a rush. Uh, fine, I'll pick I'll pick the chick. Uh, Morgan, she's my favorite. She's sexy. I don't know, between her and Chung Lee. Chung Lee's OG, but Morgan is sexier. Oh, man, you know what? I'll take them both. Uh, I, hey, I love cartoons, man. Cartoon characters, man, they all sexy. Oh, I also took out the category of the... Um, I'll show you later. All right, it's working fine. Okay, I took out the category of the adult games. So if you want it back on, I can show you how to put it back on. It's pretty easy and simple, very easy, right? I took out a bunch of category that, is, that does not need to be there. Is you know like two player, four player. It just cluttered the screen, too much scrolling. You know, so you what you do? You press start. You get into the emulation station, right? And then you go to um, game collection setting. You press the short button right here. Then you go to right here the like system display automatic game collection. What go? What is this automatic game collection? Right. All games you check or uncheck. Favorite I uncheck. Uh, two player, four player. Oh, I should check two player games, but man, eh, yeah, maybe let's check. I take oh, okay, two player, four player. I take that out. No need, never play. No need that. Rich arts achievement. And uh, what else I took out? I hit here's the adult. See that the adult right here. You can check it, press the short button to check it. A little too loud, right? But I uncheck that, so I leave adult out. I adventure casino. Nah, I uncheck that too. Clutter, casual, casual game. I uncheck that. Fight, fight games. Fight. I check that. Racing. I uncheck that. Demo. Various pinball. All this you can check. You, can, you want to do shortcut? You can just go down here and select all. It's like everything. But too much scrolling. No stuttering. Maybe you could stutter too. But let's go back. I adding the two player section in there. So. It should show up as a two-player section. Also, if you want the CPS3, it's in there, but it won't load. The C CPS3, 
Uh, go back to uh, game collection again. There is a CPS3 here. I didn't check it because I left it open. Some of you guys will fix it. There it is, CPS3. Cave, Dolphin, Neo Geo, all that. That's, that's, that's for all this here. There's your two player games, right? It popped up. So all two player games. All nothing but two player games. All right? Uh, like an uh, acclaim, we try that. Uh, with Delphine, right? Data East, Iram, Delico, Midway. Oh, example. Example. Let me go. Let's, let's go to Mortal Kombat, right? Other game runs fine, but for some reason, the Mortal Kombat. It's just so slow. A little more. If I mess around a little more, like tinkering it with in in um, retro arc, maybe it'll work better. You guys can do research into all that, but other than that, it's gonna be okay. Press any button. To continue. Any button. What's going on? Uh, press start. He says any button. All right, it's a coin. See how, see, see, how, see how slow that is? Let me try the other version. There's two different versions. No, let, you know what? Let's go into Retro Arc. If I can get in. Now, this is now this is the fun part. I can't get in Retro Arc. Let's try exit. Okay, I can exit. Okay. Now, that version I tried right there is no good. Remember that. You can go in into the ROM, the ROM and go to um, main. I think it's under main, right? And then you to delete uh, one of the two. Make sure you save two of them first. You see that one right there? Let's try the, sec the, 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 the first one, the first Mortal Kombat, right? That's why I left it because I was confused because there's two versions of Mortal Kombat ROMs. One will work better than the other. Now, we, now I found out because I finally sat down and test two different versions of MK, and I know which one's good. But I'm not gonna load in and start over and start editing my buildings, upload again. No, now this one's pretty quick. Now this one works. You see the sound? The sound issue. Same goes with more come back too. See it slow? Let's go let's go into Retro Art to see how that works, right? So I'm gonna press short to go back. The short kick. I not the short the forward kick. Then you go to setting video. Then you go thread video. Let's turn that off. Turn it back on and see what happened. Let's go to back to uh version. Okay. Now it's better now. That works, right? Let's go to sound. Now the sound's having a problem. Let's see. Let's see if you can find sound in here somewhere. T override option. Audio. This audio. This is 448 hertz, for uh, 48,000 hertz. Let's try 41,000 hertz. Let's see what happened. Okay, the, the video is smooth, but the sound, let's go back to, let's go to option again. Audio, 41, right? Well, let's try 3,000. Let's try 3,000, see how that works. Go back, back, quick menu, resume. Okay, to enter, how do I enter that? What the hell? All right, it's a little better, the sound. Let's try it again. 
Let's go to auction. Let's try 22 hertz. The sound is getting a little better, still scratchy, right? So you guys know the drill, right? I'm not gonna sit here and try to figure out the sound for you guys. I'm gonna try one more. Let's try 11 that. Since I'm already at it, let's do it one time only. Let's try it again. For the auction. Audio. CD soundtrack. Let's try that one. Let's try to see if that works. Bypass audio skew. I don't know what that means. Let's try, let's try to not off. Let's see if that works. Oh, they're getting a little better. Getting a little better. The sound's still scratchy. Like scratch, scratch, scratch. The speaker's been ripped. Let's try 8,000 hertz. Oh, right, it's getting better. It's getting better. Uh, Option. Audio. What's 48,000? That's it. Uh, 3,000. What's only 8,000 works really well. Let's try that. All right. Run smooth. MK run smooth. I fixed MK. All right. Let's try MK2. Now, this is a tutorial I think is going <laughs> to the video is going to be a bit long because I got to show you some game that might have uh, videos and sound issues. Try MK2, right? But you can always play MK2 on other systems like uh, PlayStation and um, Sega CD, right? Neo Arcade Perfect. See how this works. Oh, MK2 looks like it's working pretty well. You want to go a little bit? Oh, the video's a little slow. All right, the video's slow. All right, then you go, uh, go back. Setting, video, thread video, turn that back on. Let's see what happened. Quick menu, resume. Look at that, boys. Fix. Look at that. The gameplay, smooth. There it is, right? You got witness that. No, it's gotta mess around. Right, okay. It's a success. Let's try MK3. Hmm. Nah, not all will work. I'm letting you know that. But this works. Wow. Okay. Let's try MK3. Alright. See what happened. There's two versions. You see this two version? So I left it there for you to pick which one works better for you. Alright, I'm gonna go to open board games. Alright. I'll tell you it's one of my favorite open board games. Now, on open board, you can't get into the um, retro art. Alright, let's try X Men vs. Street Fighter. There's lots of cool open board games, guys. Now, not all open board games will work, 
maybe you have maybe you're running to like three or four not working but i'm not going to test all of them to see which one's not working oh uh, hell no you can find out you can do it yourself plug plug the micro sd into the uh pc and uh very easy and simple and that's about it and uh don't forget to go into this like that one that, like that one they didn't load right just, uh, if that didn't load um let's go back to start put a um, system setting again uh go to uh, developer and navigate to we detect all games playing region. All right, let's go click go back. Let it boot up. I'm not sure what's causing the problem. Sometimes it get hiccups. It could be PCB or maybe the version 33. So who cares? It's working, right? So to go shortcut to open board, right? You press the forward kick on the bottom. You navigate that. And you go to ports. Where's this ports right here? It says open board and ports. Click that. See how fast it goes? Two versions. Remember the first one doesn't work. Start the second one to see it works. X Men vs Street Fighter. Uh, it's like a oh, damn chair hitting this thing. Yeah. How's that? All right. Start game. New game. That works all right there's two versions so one works and one doesn't i, love, I just love beating them up it is awesome all right let's try this x-men sagas Special move, fireball move. You come out, come a special move. All right, it's good enough. That's good enough for that. That works fine. Let's try this. What's this? Oh, yeah, press up or down, pick a different color. Ah, I like red. It looks sexy. Pink doesn't look right on her.
sexy bees. Uh, oh, damn. Yeah, babe. Fireball moves, look at that, huh? Too many dudes, what's going on? Uh, one chick, all these dudes? <laughs> uh, that's enough, enough. Oh my God, I'm gonna get hooked on this. Jeez, it's so good. All right, it's good enough. That's good enough for that. That works fine. Okay. Uh, what else is different? There's too much X Men, War Heroes. What's this? There's a lot of game open borders. Jesus. I'm gonna try one, maybe a few more open board games. There's some cool ones that yeah, I need to check it out. Oh hell yeah, it hurts. Jeez. Oh, yeah. Press up or down, pick different color. Ah, I like red. She looks sexy. Pink doesn't look right on her. Fireball moves, look at that, huh? Too many dudes, what's going on? Uh, one chick, all these dudes? <laughs> uh, that's enough, enough. Oh my God, I'm gonna get hooked on this. Jeez, it's so good. I don't know, is my camera trying to focus or something? What's going on over here? My camera's still still. Uh, I don't know what to try. Oh, what is this? Ultimate. Oh, there's turtles in there too. There's so much. It's, no, you guys have to check it out yourself because there's just so many, so many stuff I want to show you guys. The video is going to be ending in like two or three hours. Forget it. I think this will be the last one. Enough. But anyways, guys, hope y'all enjoy this. You know, you know, it took me three weeks to figure out what the hell's going on. It's a lot better than before when I first started. When I first started, uh, trust me. When, as soon as I load, I load in. It, it it works fine for like five minutes. After that, it just froze. You know, I cannot even navigate like this anymore because of, due to the um, the videos. Loading, I find I finally you know solved the problem, figured out what's going on, so I had to take out all the video snap, every single video snap, replace it just pictures. Um, I asked Scott, Scotty Retro, hey, uh, send me the putting the pictures for the uh, for the build, for the theme. No, it's taking too long to load this one. Forget it. Uh, I'm messing with that. Exit that out.
you in the next one. Where do I go? I don't know, but anyway, that's the Lamar brother. All right. Let me tell one more. One last open board, and then we'll talk about my theme. Thanks to Retro, Scotty Retro. Metal slug, huh? Open ball metal slug. Uh, uh. See what I mean? Final fight heroes. Not bad. Let me see if I can mess with the screen. Make it wider. If I do mess with the screen, it might not work. Let's try it, alright? Let's try this. Let's go, let's go to end game. End game, right? Let's go to the screen. Let's go to the auction. Video. Oh, that's the sound. How do you go back? Oh, yeah, go back. Video auction. Look at that, boys. Full screen. Ah. Go back. Oh, what did I do? Uh, go back. Back. Start the game. Let's see how this looks. Let's try to pick a different, different character. Try to. Uh, I like to leave better than Cammy. Much better. Right? As you can see, you just gotta mess around with under option. See full screen option. Damn, too many things going on, on the screen. Is that the game style? Pause like that, or is it? But anyways, now we're almost getting to the guys. Oh.
Go back. Nothing. You press start, right? Let's say you want to change your liking, your style. Go to UI setting. You press the short. And you go under theme configuration, right? It's too loud. I am menu nine. Let's go back to menu one. Let's start over with one. I'm on game carousel. Just leave it there. Clear logo. You want light blue logo? All right, let's go back. Let's go back. This is theme one, menu one, theme one. This is the start menu and shut down. When you do that, it automatically reboot. So no choice but to turn off the power. That's about it. You cannot do a safe shutdown. Hopefully there's a, uh, somebody come up with a script for a safe shutdown. Safe that way, because every time you turn on and off, on and off, the, your micro SD or any storage drive will might, might get corrupted. And make sure you back up that way you download, back it up and uh, just copy it over again and everything will be fine. But turn it off and on will be, uh, oh, it didn't change. Go to menu one, go to uh, UI. Do your uh, configuration. Let's go to menu one, clear logo, All right? Let's go back, let it load again. Now that's the menu one, right? Now you want to change the, the logo for the UI, theme, uh, maybe light blue, right? Let's go back. Now it freeze, right? Now it's what you do is wait, either wait or turn off and turn on. Let it reboot for that clear logo to uh, let it kick in. Right? So, turn it off. So every time you change a theme, you're gonna have to do this. That sucks. That's how it works for this PCB. That's how the build is. I've been trying for three weeks, trying to figure out what the hell is going on. That is the only load up a game real quick. Okay guys, because I need, the volume does not work until you load up a game, right? I'm gonna load up one game, any game. So, so in order for the volume to work, you need to load up one game for it to kick in. Then the volume will work. When you exit, the volume will work again. It's just so stupid. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's so dumb. Hopefully there's a better script out there somebody can create it. Okay, volume works, right? Let me exit out. So this thing gets really loud when you first boot up. Very loud. I mean, the speakers right underneath, it, it's, it's like a reflection off the wall of the sound. Sound effect off the wall it makes it even louder. So the smaller the, the reflection, the louder it gets, is like in a box. It's like, it just gets louder. Yeah, once you get in, are you right? Right. Um, that was menu one. Let's go UI again. Go to uh, theme configuration. Let's go to menu two. That was a light blue logo, right? It's probably gold logo. How's that? Huh? Gold logo represent to die for. Woo! It is menu three. The gold logo, right? Menu 3, let me load up a quick game so I can load this volume. Now you hear me 
talking. That's menu three. It's up to 13. This one special one that I requested it. Oh, wait until the uh, menu 13. I'll surprise you guys. Uh, menu 13. All right. Give a shout out to Scotty. Woo, Scotty Retro. All right, here's uh, menu number, uh, what menu is this? Menu number three. With a gold. Or you can change into uh, blue. But it might blend in too much. Won't be able to see it. All right, green, let's try purple. Right. Let me load up one game, you know. So lower the volume. Any game. So the volume doesn't work. There it is. See that? Let's go back. Let's go to um, UI setting, theme, menu four. That was purple, clear, light blue. Try light blue. It is the um, special theme that I uh, specially requested. My master, Monkey King. Yeah. Scotty, you brought my master in here. Y'all don't know what, what, what his Monkey King is? Google it. Okay, everything is running smooth now. Back to my uh, original theme. If I were you, leave it as is, right? Less waiting for it to load everything up again. Every time you uh, change a theme, it's gonna start freezing. Uh, uh, you know, you gotta reboot into the theme fully loaded and all the other games to the uh, loaded games, just like the ad games. So it does take a while to load everything up in order for it to be stable. It won't be 100% stable due to PCC, PCB and the RAM is, is, is so, oh my God, it's, I don't know, it needs more RAM, okay? So, everything looks smooth. And um, last but not least, one last announcement. Um, Scotty Rachel, I did give him a, um, MK counter key. He's gonna build MK theme for the uh, MK counter key. Also, my build will work on the MK counter key or any counter key. Only two counter key I re highly recommend is the marble and the MK. Now, the NBA Jam and the Turtle 
it's a nose. Two buttons. I'm not gonna, you know, sit down looking for two button games only. Forget that. So I highly recommend grabbing Marvel and MK. That is your best bet right now. Other than that, that's it, guys. Um, I'm gonna upload. Uh, I know I'm forgetting a lot of stuff I want to say, but Merry Christmas, everyone. Hope y'all enjoy this. Please leave me a comment and feedback when you get this built. I know it's gonna be a lot of questions, a lot of answers to be answered. And uh, it's gonna be a lot of um, a freeze and lag as I show in the video. Just give it some time, let it kick in. Let the build kick in into the PCB. After that, you will get less frozen, less freeze, less, less of everything, right? So hope you all enjoy this. Merry Christmas everyone again. And clean like a mother, yeah, yeah, yeah. To die for Scotty Retro. Woo! My man, Scotty. Damn.